I love fried tilapia. It's so easy to make and incredibly delicious. For this recipe, if you have an outdoor kitchen, you can utilize it because your house will smell like fish. I have a bunch of tilapia that I'm cu cutting in half, salt, pepper, thyme, and coriander into this, and then marinate everything before you add it to your eggs. You need two large eggs here to coat the tilapia, and we'll pick up all of these flavors again in the butternut squash and the balsamic dressing we're going to coat this in after it's done. The butternut squash is just uh, frozen from the freezer. I'm gonna use two bags, which is I think two pounds. You can use fresh, of course, why not? But makes it easier. I always have some kind of uh, frozen vegetables in my freezer, it makes my life so much easier. Olive oil, salt and pepper, and a little bit of thyme. We're gonna put this on the stove, let it do its thing. And every so often we're gonna go into it and mash it a little bit because it's gonna be like a mash. We're going to use the same spices, thyme, coriander. You can skip them, you can use them, you can add whatever you want. This is your food, remember, you don't have to like what I like. If you don't like thyme and you wanna put rosemary, go ahead. We're gonna beat the two eggs really well. And then add your fish into the eggs and give it a coating. All your fish should be coated in the egg because we're going to fry the fish that way. Truly, if you have never done this before, frying your tilapia like that, you should. And now for my finished um, dressing for this, the drizzle, I have olive oil, some balsamic, two cloves of garlic, just crushed, and then lemon zest. A whole lemon zest goes into this and you're just gonna cook that and caramelize it. It's gonna be sweet, it's gonna be tangy, it's gonna be lemony and acidy, it's delicious. I'm just gonna let that cook, you see, on low heat until everything is nice and cooked. And the juice of that lemon, we're gonna put on top of the tilapia as well when it's done. See the butternut squash is, is starting to defrost and get together and cook. You see how golden the fish is? Amazing, just amazing, I love it. This is an amazing meal to make for your family, for everybody to get together and enjoy. I'm going to serve this in a huge plate, family style, and because I love that kind of food service. I love to serve everything in huge plates where everybody can dig in and take as much as they want. You can go for seconds or even thirds. So we have our butternut squash mesh that we're going to create a bed with it for the tilapia. Look at the beautiful color. I love the color yellow in my food. In general, I love the color yellow. I always take little snippets of food when I'm serving it or cooking it. So you see like the crunchy bits of the fish all go in my mouth. <laughs> Let's drizzle this in the finish we made, in that balsamic finish, gorgeous. And then everything is just going to drip into your mash and make it incredibly delicious and so appetizing. Looking at this, I'm just dreaming of more. I hope you loved it. Please give me a thumbs up. Thank you.